on the night that Christ was to be betrayed, he could have been greedy with his life. Hallelujah. He could have turned around and walked away. Yes. He could have chosen to die a human natural death. Yes. But he chose to be generous with his life mm. so that we could have abundance. Yes. And in offering himself, in giving of himself, on that night he took bread blessed it and breaking it he said this is my body which I give to you when you eat of this bread remember me Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. in likewise manner he took a cup mm -hmm. and blessing it he passed it to his disciples and he said this is the cup of the new and everlasting covenant this is the cup that flows abundantly and generously. This is the cup that never dries, but yet fills all so that all can be quenched. Oh, yes, and yes, all yes. he asks is that we share this cup. And in doing so, we remember him. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Let us pray. Loving God, we give you thanks for these gifts and for these elements. We thank you for all present here. Bless us and bless these gifts Thank you. with the infusion of your spirit so that they may be made for us as we can perceive them, the body and blood, the presence of Christ, so that we can be Christ in the world today. In the name of Christ we pray, amen. Can I invite them? Yes. This is a table that our Lord and Savior left for us. He made every one of you welcome. No forcing, no pushing, no have to, no rules. Just, I want you to remember me right. at this table. Right. No, I didn't pray. No, I got high last night. None of that. Remember me, what I did for you at this table. Leave yourself out of it. Amen. Come to this table that I have left for you. Metropolitan Community Church is offering the same thing. That same welcoming that you meet us at that door and see the smiling faces, the hugs and the handshakes, it's right here at this table as well. We invite you to come and share the table that our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ felt that you were worthy to take. You were worthy, regardless of what you think about yourself. That's right. Jesus thinks you're worth dying for. Jesus thinks that you're worth him getting beat up for. You're welcome. You don't have to belong to any church. You may not even be baptized. You may not even understand this theology that we have going here at this church. But you do understand, come to a table that has been set for you, you are welcome. For those of you who do not wish for us to serve you, you may serve yourself. You may come, there will be a table with the bread and the juice. We use juice because we respect some of our shortcomings here. So it is grape juice, but it is representing the blood of Jesus. Amen. Come, my sisters and brothers. With Follow the ushers. The ushers. Yes. <laughs> Follow the ushers. We don't ever want to forget to tell you to follow the ushers. And acolytes and, usher, and the ushers, please come forward. Thank and you. servers, please come forward. Okay. 